Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Alphone IT and the topic of my today's video is about portable apps. Today in this video I will be discussing about the port portable apps as well as their importance and how to set up it in your USB flash drive. So let me start uh, my video. So first of all you can know that uh, portable apps means some of the apps that can be stored in your USB flash drives and used without installing them in your computer let me clarify the uses of the flash drives uh, as the as the container of the portable app so usb flash drives can be used as another computer by the help of portable apps the portable uh, the usb device which contains a portable apps works as another computer or another hard disk on your computer which is storing them and installing them but it runs without installing in your original computer disk so let me first of all uh, explain the benefits of using portable apps. The main importance of the portable apps or benefit of the portable apps is the, your privacy. Uh, what I mean by privacy is that when you want to go to uh, go to another person computer or you want to run something on other person computer, uh, then you have to use your own Gmail account on that computer. But uh, there may be some of the data chances of being data loss because of this or data leak because of this. So you can just uh, use uh, your Chrome browser that is installed on your flash drive. It's not only it's not only with the Gmail account. You can choose any of the accounts that you have to log in on other person's computer. Uh, that will uh, bring you risk of your data leaks. So you can just use your flash drive, and all of your data will be saved on your flash drive. Uh, if you want, then you can copy to your home and just format your flash drive so no one can get get any of the data USB flash drives are also almost all of, almost compatible with all of the OS's uh, that you, we have on, on the market now so it will be very easier for you so let me start the process now to how can we make a uh, uh, flash drive as a portable flash drive so let me start video uh, first of all you have to go to the website portableapps.com and in the website you have to download its uh, uh, file it's just only 5 or 6 mp file you can download from this download now button i have already downloaded it so let me go back to my file manager and run the file okay, let me go to my file manager so you can see that i am keeping all of the folders in new folder file because there was a, a pre-installed portable apps software in my pen drive i am keeping all of them in another folder and i am going to install another portable apps in the same flash drive so it is not necessary that you can only use um, only add only one portable apps uh, in one flash drive you can create multiple copies of the os so let me create another one you just have to choose a new folder and for the storage you have to choose your uh, flash drive the location of the flash drive or not it will be not working so let me go to the flash drive it may take some of the time to extract all of the data from the file so let me skip this part as you can see installation has been completed so let me open this so first of all it will open directory by itself so you have to wait some for some time to open directory and you can see that i am using another one portable apps icon also that is uh, the folder that is my old one that is uh, kept in new folder program and i am also recording this by using the obs studio downloaded from portable apps so you can see that uh, the obs studio that is working is not installed in my laptop uh, it's just working from my flash drive uh, you can see a proof that uh, there in the toolbar so first of all i have to select some of the apps to install because there is no apps in the first time so i will be selecting only a uh, apps because it takes too long time for it to install so let me fast forward this part also so there will be no wastage of your time so the installation has been completed so let me show you how does it uh, look like there is a there is the application that i have uh, installed some time ago so let me see what is happening i don't know the what uh, type of apps is i just randomly install it so I think it is some kind some kind of alternative to MSO. So let me increase the font. So I don't think there is a there is option to change the size of the word. So 
let me only type it for some time and I will just close it so I am just type subscribe button and let me close it I will just close the whole portable apps and I will restart the you know, portable apps that I have just installed so you can see how does it works and what do you have to do to install new apps uh, after the first time so let me go to my file manager if you want to run the you know, portable apps on any computer you have to first of all open the file manager and click on the start button uh, that is located in your pen drive so after pressing the start button you can see that the screen has been opened and now to install new application you can see that you just have to go to that uh, get new application option so it will open the portable directory again uh, so it may take some time and it is actually offline so you don't have to worry about online anything you just have to uh, take it online if you want to install new applications or update old application so there is the directory again you can choose any of the application and install it and the installation takes quite a lot of time in this uh, program so i suggest you that you should only do it when you, you have a lot of time free or something about 15 to 20 minutes free so let me stop the recording thanks for watching the video and if you want to learn the learn about the c programming so you can just click on that i button in the uh, i button in the screen and you will you can see a playlist of the c programming that uh, i just made the video about and i'll be updating that um, list at some interval of time so go to that list if you like c programming so thank you for watching the video and uh, giving your valuable time to my uh, to my video so thank you everyone and bye bye see you in the next video